Hi, my name is Alexis Patterson and I am a high school special education teacher at Madison Central High School in Richmond, Kentucky. And I am going to show you the room where the Person First Academy will operate. The Person First Academy is a academy for students with severe, moderate to severe disabilities in the high school setting and they will be 12th to grade 14. So grade 14 means that they are transitioning out of high school and preparing for employment, preparing for life after high school. The academy will serve as a hands-on way for our kids to learn skill sets, to gain a skill set that will help them get a job once they leave Central. One of my main um, goals and one of my main desires for this program is to have a cohesive pathway for students with severe disabilities. Because when you think about it, students without disabilities, typically developed students, they have, you know, they have a structure, they have a curriculum, they have a program, they have a lot of resources for them to get from point A to point B. But resources like that don't really exist for students with moderate to severe disabilities. And so that's what the Person First Academy will do. This is really exciting because we have four different tracks and each track is geared towards potential job placements that adhere to their ability level, but also will push them past their comfort, comfort level, which is important for students in general. And it will also serve as a way for them to have hands-on practice in each academy that they are in so that they're learning how to make Food. They're learning how to clean equipment. They're learning how to work in an office space and actually have that experience so that once they are out in the community, the generalization process is not going to be too difficult for them. So without further ado, I'm going to go give you a tour. So as we're walking in, this right here is going to be the area where all of the task analyses for the academy will be. The time clock is going to be right here as well. So as soon as students walk in, they will punch the clock and their shift will start. And so, as I mentioned, there are four different academies. So I'm going to tell you an academy name, show you the space, and then move forward that way. So first we're going to look at the Food Service Academy. And in this room is where the fully renovated commercial kitchen will be. It is under construction at the moment, but once everything is ready to go and everything is set up, then it'll be really, really, really important and really cool for our students because they're gonna be working and practicing and serving the building in this space. So to give you a little bit of an idea of what's going to go where, when you walk in, the aprons are going to be lined up here in hairnets for food safety. Then we're going to have our ovens, our dishwasher, and stainless um, cabinets for food preparation along this wall. We're going to have an island for food prep and for lectures that I will be giving right here. And we're going to have a servant, a food service line, so a buffet line where students will be able to serve the building. Um, the idea is to have, like, let's say, like a potluck for the building. It will be down here, and our students will be able to serve the staff of the building. That's kind of the idea for that. And over here, over in this area, we're going to have the refrigerator, freezer for stock and things like that. So that's the food service academy kitchen area. Okay, so along this wall is going to be our clothing and retail track. And this track is really fun because they're going to not only have practice in the retail setting, but also in how to wash and dry specific materials, clothing materials, learning how to fold and certain things. So right here we're going to have our racks for the clothing, um, they'll be right 
here, kind of ready to be pushed out in a cohesive way, so they don't, no one's running all over each other. And then we're going to have our folding tables right here. So the folding tables are really important because our students need to know how to fold correctly and make sure things are not getting wrinkled, stuff like that. And the, the tables are going to be wheelchair accessible, so in case a student in a wheelchair wants to be in this academy and they are folding clothes, they can wheel right up and they can start learning how to fold. And moving forward, this is where the commercial washing, washer and dryer will be. So this is obviously the biggest part of the clothing and retail track. And the way that this whole wall is going to work is just one, two, three. It's going to be very, um, very cohesive, very, the flow is going to be nice. We want to make sure that nothing is getting mixed up. Organization is key with this uh, program. Okay, moving forward, over here is going to be our office management track. So office management is going to be where our students are going to learn how to make copies. They're going to learn how to file. We're going to create a filing system. The filing system is already actually quite good because in these cabinets, we have bins that have already been here. Each teacher is going to have a bin and they're going to put in orders for copies, orders for um, laminating, things like that. And Whenever their order is done, our students are going to put it in the bin and then they can make deliveries or the teacher can come in and pick it up, but the student will know who's been based on the label, stuff like that. So that's the filing system for the academy. Everything is going to be color coded. That works really well for our students, knowing um, what each academy track, the color for that track is so that things don't get confusing. And over here, we're going to have like a wall separator, and we're going to have our copy machine back this way. You can't really see there's more space back there. Um, and our laminator too, and shredder. And we are going to have carpeting area, hopefully, so that it looks and feels like an office. That's also very, very important as well. All right, so. Over here in this area, we are going to, this will also act as our clothing and retail track, but more on the retail side. So we're going to have our clothing racks that we requested, and they're going to be open-faced, which will be excellent for wheelchair access. One's going to be here, this, this corner, here, and then here. So it'll be good separation from small, medium, large, extra large for clothing. We're going to have the Family Services Center outsource their clothing that they do upstairs for the building or operate down here. So if a student comes in and needs a shirt or a pair of pants, something you know, goes wrong, our students down here in the academy will look for the clothing, and with the clothing, sort of like a, a little clothing store, which will be really exciting for them. On the other side of this, so there's going to be a slat wall to separate. And on the other side of the wall, this area is going to be shelving for our janitorial and landscaping track. We're going to have all of our landscaping tools, so our gloves, um, our protective gear, housed in this area. So whenever a student is going outside to, I don't know, do lawn mowing, things like that, they'll just come over here and get what they need to do that. And over here, we have more shelving. And this right over here is another super cool part in the loading dock. So for the loading dock, deliveries come here for the building. And our students are going to learn how to unload truck, stock the shelves for janitors. And for the janitorial track, they are going to hopefully do toilet paper refills in the bathrooms. They're going to take requests for uh, teachers to clean their rooms during their planning period. So if they ever need like a wipe down on the desks or like a quick sweep, um, our students are going to do that for them as well. And I think 
that is all. So as you can see, the Person First Academy is going to be an awesome experience for students with moderate to severe disabilities. And the opportunities are super, super great for our kids with this program. And we would really appreciate you to come alongside of us to make this dream come true for our students.